Hey, Matrix 47 here. We've made it back to the, or uh, we've made it to the I-88 trading post, it's called. What's up, man? Honored to speak with you, sir. Well, thank you. Really, thank you. Samuel! Welcome to the 188 slopping shops. Like our wow. slogan says, <laughs> it's better than nothing. Super impressed. You gonna drink that whole bottle? I can suit you for sale. Mm. Wow. He drained it like a boss. You have absolutely nothing that I need. Although, if you look, it's very, very curious. He has 849 caps. And I have 10 times more than that exactly. I wonder if that was on purpose. How strange is that? Super duper strange. Uh, yeah, we'll keep that for now, I guess. Don't need those. Don't need those, although they're super nice. Can you do one more? Yeah. Pulse grenades are good for killing robots. Mm, keep that for now. Squirrel bits. Nope. Nope. <clears throat> I keep forgetting I have that many uh, Sunset Sarsaparillas. Thank you. Actually. You're most kind. Hey, hey, Veronica. No offense, but you look like you've traveled a long way down some bad roads. Where'd you come from? Felicia Day, hot. Actually, looks a little bit like Felicia Day too, which I think is cool. I came from the grave. Huh. Well, in that case, I take it back. You look pretty good, given the circumstances. I think so well, too. Welcome, thank man. you. I'm Veronica. I live in a hole in the ground. Oh yeah. Well, like a, a hobbit. Worker, if you want to get technical, I think which is probably a, a, a hobbit reference. She's nerdy like anymore. that. I'm usually out here picking up food and supplies for my family. Whatever they need. So you just leave your family in the bunker? Yeah, I'm not worried. They can handle it. Fair them. enough. And actually these days, I think they'd rather Ooh. have me out here. So listen. Sure. I had a run-in with this group calling themselves the Brotherhood of Steel. They're usually harmless unless you use advanced technology around them. Well, that shouldn't be a problem for me. I can't afford anything like that. Hey. So, where are you headed, anyway? Hidden Valley. Uh, I go where I'm needed, Guess actually. Guess we have that in common, then. Yeah. I'll be honest. You're the first person I've run across out here that looks like he can really handle himself. Cool. There are places I've never been to that'd be too dangerous for just me. What do you think? Maybe we could travel together. Help each other out. Uh, okay. Now you're talking. One thing you should know first, though. I asked you about the Brotherhood because I'm one of them. I know. Okay. You still okay? Yeah. I'm great at punching people. I'm not going to lie. It's a gift. Well, <laughs> thanks for taking a chance on a naive young girl from California with stars in her eyes and a pneumatic gauntlet on her hand. Okay. Let's hit the road, huh? Sure. A bunch of shut-ins who scorn outsiders and hold technology over them. Gee, where have I heard that one before? Yay! Uh, well, we're going to the Hidden Valley, which is over here. But we need to go... We'll go to Sloan first. Well, we'll go to Sloan because it's... Yeah. Just a quick little jaunt southeast. Whew. The Swift Learner perk is dumb. Don't ever take it. It's pointless. It's a waste. <laughs> it's a waste of a perk. There's so much to do that you typically, by the end of the game, assuming you don't have the DLC and and your and your level cap is at 30, even then you're still limpy. 
Alright, that's cool. Uh, anyway, the issue is that way before you actually finish the game, assuming you do side quests, you're level 30. And you got nothing else. There's nothing else. Oh, yeah, these are uh, bark scorpions over here by the Hidden Valley. We're going to your house, lady. Well, you know, not her house per se, but definitely where some yos live. Shut up. This is your house. Boop. Oh, I missed. There we go. Whoa. What just happened? Seriously? That's crazy. Like the sky just changed colors immediately. No clouds rolled in or nothing. Don't get me wrong, I mean... Oh. Good on ya. Kill him in the face. Nice work. Is this it? This is not it. Hidden Valley Bunker. Wait. That's where one of the books is. Uh oh. No, that's okay. I was really confused just now, and I don't want my game to freak out too much. But <laughs> we're starting to get glitches. Uh, this is bad. This is bad, okay? You know what? I'll look it up later. It's totally cool. Uh oh. Come on now. You'd be nice. What the frick? There's a lot of yo standing out over here. Hi there. My name is April Whoa. Mortimer. I monitored a communication earlier between you and someone with the Brotherhood of Steel. I'm with the followers of the Apocalypse. We're much more liberal about the sharing of technology than those Brotherhood people. Bring your robot to us. We'll see that whatever information it may have on it is used for the greater good. Uh... Dang it! I'm all sad and stuff. Whoa. Brotherhood guys, what's up, man? What are they doing? I don't know, I haven't been in there yet. Okay, so this is an issue that I need to look up because I don't know which one I want to do. Render unto Caesar. No, this is a side quest. The side quest, or I believe they are called miscellaneous quests are listed after. Alright, let's see. April Mortimer. Gotcha. Right. Uh, we're gonna bring... <clears throat> In fact, we'll go ahead and do that now. Even though I found the front door immediately. I need to go... What? What's that about? Oh! Yes. We're gonna go right here. See, my issue with that 
with having to choose between the followers and the Brotherhood of Steel is th due to the nature of computer data you should be able to copy it so I bring it to the followers and they do their thing and upgrade Eddie's weapons and then I bring him to the Brotherhood of Steel they get their data they get their copy of the data and then they upgrade his armor what's what's the deal with that man <sighs> it's cool no worries part of another thing uh, part of why I'm bringing Eddie to the f the followers is for follower fame hey, hey. food guy is he armless that would be kind of cool to see because you don't really see any characters in the in this game that are, have missing limbs like nobody they're all complete and together the only time that you see people with missing limbs is when they're on medical beds and you fix them up and you have to sever limbs they're not dead but they you know oh my legs gone Oh no. Julie. Come back here, Julie. Don't go in there. No. Ah. Thank you. Oh, it's April. It. Let's talk here about we go. that robot. My bad. What would you like it for? I've heard through our channels that it has some research that may be related. Cool. I'd like to get what I can from it and use that data for the good of humanity. Okay. Why can't I do both? Dang it. Okay, you can take it for a while. Thank you. I'll get it back to you as soon as I can with the upgraded weapon systems. Sure. Can I do both? Maybe I can do both. I don't know. Let's go back to the hidden valley. Who are neutral to me because I have not even spoken to them yet. Bronkin can, can get me in, which is lovely and amusing, actually. Do 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 What? Oh, sure. Punch his face. Punchy punchy. Uh Okay. Guess I need to activate the quest. Cause I don't know. Where is that at? Oh you're kidding me. Really? Huh. Okay. Whatever. So we got three in game days. And here it is, yeah. Hidden Valley Bunker. Hidden Valley Bunker. Yeah. I use regular pew pew weapons. I don't really use energy weapons that much. Oh, this is so good. Seriously. It's really entertaining. Hold on, I've got this. <laughs> I'd like a large atomic shake and a double Brahmin burger. And easy on the agave sauce this time. We gave you a password, Bronca. It's for your safety. I know yeah. where you live, Ramos. Open up. For Pete's sake. Opening up. Welcome back, Veronica. Welcome back, Veronica. Feel common. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. 
Guess we gotta go all the way down, and then we get approached by this bloke. Listen up. I'm in charge of security around here, and I can't say I'm too happy about having an outsider waltzing around. But since you came in with the yeah. America, I'm inclined to cut you a little slack. Oh, sure. I mean, Ella's going to want to talk. He's to on the second level. He's Just take a right once you get down there. My office is right here in case you need anything. Just gotcha. Ask the Ramos. Will do. And with that, we're out of time. Yay! Out of time. Yay! <laughs> so yeah. Till next time, ladies and gentlemen, follow me tuna, and we'll see you next video.